Hello everyone. Welcome back to Come Paint With Me. I have a little bit of a new setup here. So I don't have my chair. <laughs> and uh, I'd have to sit down here to talk to you. So um, I'm just going to take it from up here. How's that? Um, I am going to do a uh, painting for a friend. Ken missioned me to do a painting. Just a little one for bathroom wall that I just painted and she has this baby pink color in there not much other other color because it's white and the walls are kind of uh, maybe like a, a taupey color um, uh, not like start out with paint all over me again so they have um a striped shower curtain and the shower curtain is white and it has like charcoal gray stripes running down it and it's almost black so i'm going to use this custom color that i made and then i'm going to use the uh I think the metallic black by Artist Loft. That's really a charcoal gray. I think that'll pretty it up. I also have the sterling silver by Deco Art out just in case I want to use that. And this is the neutral gray. Um, the Quitex Basics. There's nothing special about it. And then just so I have some pink on hand if I think it's not pinking up enough. Because there's just not a lot of color in there if I just use that light pink. So I may just put a little bit of this in there. And this is called Purple Red Master's Touch. Doesn't look purple or red. So just give my paints a little shake. And get my other glove on here. The base is going to be Artist Loft Flow Acrylic white with Floetrol and water. I have it in this bottle and then I have a little bit of extra in this bottle. It's a formula bottle. Somebody say for me. My granddaughter. So there we go. Hard to break the seal on that. So I'm going to use the rest of this and pour it out. I'm going to try, I'm going to do the black first. I don't even know how I'm going to do this. I just want to try it. I just want to see, you know, I always, this is why I buy the smaller um, canvases, just so I can do a little test. Now, I'm going to be using this pink here so it's it's fading quite a bit let me just put some silver on there don't put too much silver silver kind of tends to not dry well so um, I don't know why I would even use this because it just doesn't seem to be in the color family that I'm using, but I'm putting it in there. That's how it goes. All right. Now it's up to the hairdryer. It looks like everything is too thin because it's all just melting together. But here goes the hair dryer. I'm 
my little Flo. She is very little, but she's mighty. I'll test her out again. So I'm going to blow. Hmm. May I don't even know how I'm gonna do this. Let's blow up. No, let's blow down. So I didn't use any of that hot pink and I really wish I would have because as you can see there's not a lot of color there and here comes the white cells so I don't know what to do but I am just going to put me a little bit in certain places and then just see if I can spread it out a little bit. Okay, no, that's a big fat no. I, I like this, but I got to, there's too much paint on there. I should still be um, even level. Oops, I don't have my squirt bottle set up for my edges yet. I need to do that. Okay, this time I'm going to spread it with the hair dryer. Okay, so I'm going to use the um, pink color again and the gray, a little bit of silver, and I'm going to do it a little different. I think I'm just going to run it blow one way and blow the other way. I like it when it's when you can blow and then you blow the other way. It makes a kind of a twisty so I'm going to start out with pink then here goes my black metallic black there's my gray There's my silver. And there's the custom color. Let's see, still. Hmm. Okay, well. Here we go. Let's let's give it a shot. See if I can make it twisty.
like it, but it's not a wow. If you know what I mean, everybody does a painting that they go, eh, it's all right. And that's exactly what I feel for this. And I don't want to give, do a commission piece that I'm eh, okay with. I want to do a commission piece that is gorgeous. Because people are going to come in her house and they're going to say, where did you get that painting in the bathroom? And she'll be able to say me. So, I hope this has been informative. I like to show what not to do. And I'm better at that. Um, but I have created some really nice paintings that I feel are really, really nice. Um, and it's not that this one isn't. It just isn't what I was going for. I know everybody has said that. but So, if it was informative, entertaining, if you liked it, give me a thumbs up. And... Then subscribe, hit the bell, that way you'll get notifications when I, when I do this again and I get the right thing, hopefully. So, I hope you'll come back and paint with me. Have a great rest of your day.